Hi, I'm Patu from Free Cal. For the past year or so, I've been working with the SEBI Investment Awareness Team to create financial tools and calculators in the SEBI Investment Awareness website. This is at investor.sebi.gov.in. So if you go there, you can see the financial tools and calculators tab on the top and there is a check your financial health tab. So uh, about nine of the calculators in the financial tools and calculators tab uh, were taken from my book you can be rich too with goal based investing co written with pv subramaniam and uh, this check your financial health is a recent uh, tool that i have uh, created and uh, they have just uploaded it in the website so i want to walk you through these tools uh, i will probably do the walkthrough of the calculators in another website i will do the walkthrough of the financial health uh, in this video so i want to get rid of the uh, webcam so if you look at this financial uh, tools and calculators tab, there are several tools, about nine of them are uh, from the You Can Be Rich 2 book. Several of them have got uh, videos that I have made. So for example, if you look at the cost of retirement planning delay. The cost of delay calculator is essential. That's my voice. So you can see there are tutorial videos for about four or five of those uh, calculators. You can have a go look at that. And uh, what I would like to do now is to walk through this financial health check tool. So let's start. Do you have anyone who depends on you financially? Let's select yes. And then it will ask, do you have life insurance cover for at least 10 or uh, for at least 15 to 20 times your annual income? So let's select no. And then it will tell you what you should do. It will give you the recommendation immediately. What, how much life insurance you should have and so on. Do you have health insurance applicable uh, health insurance for yourself, excuse me, and for all your dependents? So if you say uh, you can select, I do not have health insurance. I have health insurance by my employer. I have personal health insurance. I have both personal and employer insurance. I have health insurance provided by central or state government. So I, I can just type, I do not have health insurance. It, it should, it will recommend what you need. And how well can you suddenly handle sudden unexpected expenses? I cannot, I can handle small emergency expenses. So now it gives you, it's a, so it's a traffic light kind of advice, red, uh, yellow and green. It's a positive start, but you can, you, but you should be able to build your emergency fund more, etc. If you have a credit card, do you manage to pay the bill in full? I don't have a credit card. I, I pay in full each month. Occasionally I pay, I fail to pay in full. I often do not pay in full. So I pay in full each month. So then it gives you the green signal. Do you have any personal loans or unsecured loans? So you can say yes. And then it will say these are uh, bad loans. You should get rid of them as, as soon as possible. Is your uh, total EMI you pay towards your home loan, car loan, personal loan, etc. greater than 40% of your monthly take home pay? If it is yes, you would say that's too high, then you'll have to uh, refinance some debt, etc. and so on. And it, ev at every possible instant, it will say, get advice from a registered investment advisor. Do you create a budget for your income? And say yes. And then have you calculated the corpus uh, needed for you to retire comfortably? So here it links to the financial goal planner available on the SEBI investment website. This again is a tool uh, from the You Can Be Rich 2 book. Are you investing enough for retirement? Then it gives you that. Uh, have you shared the details of your investments with your spouse or children or other dependents as applicable or relevant? And have you added nomination details to all your investments? So it will. Have you made a will? This will allow you to distribute your assets to your relatives and nominee as per your wishes. So again, and then that's it. And then once the health check is done, it will give you a consolidated report. It will tell you the areas of concern and then in areas to improve and the areas of where you are displaying good financial wealth, uh, go, sorry, financial health, excuse me. So have a, um, you know, uh, uh, try with this financial health check and also try the financial tools and calculators and let me know if you have any feedback. Bye-bye.